Hello, lovely people. Let's try that again with my microphone actually turned on. <laughs> my name is Emma. Welcome back to my channel. Uh, apologies for anyone viewing this later. It's a little bit awkward, a little bit lower quality than usual. This is going out as a live stream. Hello and thank you to everyone who is watching now. So, I, uh, I am here to give you a little bit of an update on my life and my channel. So... Oh, I've, ju I've just gotten off uh, a nearly two hour call with a friend where we were preparing stuff for an update for next week for a secret project that's been going on for a while that we're going to reveal next week. So keep an eye out for that. But I am like, I'm buzzed uh, <laughs> from doing that for a while. Also, I just burned my tongue on coffee. So that's how things are going right now. So, on to the actual news then. Um, I might do like a bullet point rundown of this later because there's quite a lot to cover. Um, so, uh, the first thing, most people, uh, if you've watched a little bit of my stuff, you're probably aware that I do have, there's an ice cream van in the background being creepy, don't worry about that. Uh, I do have a full-time job I uh, work in VFX as a VFX editor, so take that, people in the comments who tell me I should get a job, oh, I got one. Uh, <laughs> but as of next week, I'm going to be doing that job part-time in order to do more of this internet stuff. Uh, so that's really cool, really exciting. Hopefully it won't backfire horribly. I think it's going to be really good. Um, so basically I'm going to be doing two days a week uh, quite unquote real job and the rest of the week I will have dedicated to doing YouTube stuff, um, doing new projects. Uh, I want to do some more stuff for Patreon. Um, I've got a lot planned. I really want to I want to build slowly. I don't want to overwhelm and be like I'm going to do five videos a week now and then overwork and have it all not work and come crashing down so I'm gonna I'm gonna slowly build up um it also means on a selfish level it also means that uh I should hopefully be able to not work seven days a week every week which is kind of what I've been doing for a while and it is not sustainable <laughs> for a normal human being so yeah that's the main that's the main big news um I might talk a little bit more in detail, I might do it on the blog, or uh, maybe I'll talk about it on here um, sometime in the future about working in VFX in general and uh, what that is like and how employees in VFX are treated. Uh, so maybe we'll talk about that later, but yes, this should be a little bit more of a... allow me to focus more on content and also give me a bit more time to actually sleep and do laundry. So that's good stuff. Um, I've been a bit of a yes man for a while, knowing this was coming. I really want to make as many videos as possible, I want to make the highest quality content possible, so every time an opportunity has come up to do a collaboration or a project or something, I've basically just said yes, and the, therefore the seven days a week thing has been happening, so, um, but it means that I'm in a really good position right now, so very excited. Um, means I can do more stuff on random time zones. I've done a couple of shows with the ACA, um, which is amazing, but typically that means me, you know, recording with them at like 1am or something, so this should make me a bit more flexible for stuff like that, so that'll be really good. Um, so hopefully this should, yeah, be sustainable, prevent some burnout, and uh, generally be really good, get back into some more personal projects, try not to overwork. We'll see how that actually goes in practice. Uh, so, what does that actually mean for this channel and for you, the viewer, um, for the internet things? Um, so, I'm going to be scaling up a little bit at a time. So, this is how we're going to work kind of from uh, June onwards. Uh, there you go. <laughs> Here's a graphic I made earlier. Um, so Saturday is basically going to continue as normal. I'm going to continue posting a video 
every Saturday. The only slight difference there is it's going to be specifically skeptic themed content. So religion, conspiracies, things like that. Um, that's going to be Saturdays. And then for the time being, I'm going to do every other Wednesday for alternative videos, videos that fall slightly outside of the usual um, stuff like book, book reviews, talking about influencers, uh, news, things like that. Um, so that is how that's going to work. And then for the few people who are interested, uh, the gaming channel is going to essentially carry on as per because I got overexcited and uh, <laughs> started increasing my gaming schedule just because I wanted to play a lot of games. So that's basically going to continue. At the moment, we've got Minecraft Mondays. Um, Tuesday is mostly Pokemon Legends. Uh, I'm going to start interspersing that with other games. Thursdays, at the moment, we've got alternating between the Sinking City and Buddy Simulator. Obviously, these will change as games finish and new stuff comes out and whatever. And Fridays typically will be multiplayer games with uh, friends, with people from other channels. Uh, I've done a couple of videos in Escape Simulator with Conla that are really fun. Um, and uh, th this week, actually, I've got a solo video on Friday tomorrow, but it's very stupid and a lot of fun. So uh, check that out. And then over on Twitch, things are going to be basically the same. Uh, we're still, we've still got Weird Wednesday, we've still got Spoopy Saturday. Those are still at the same times. They start at 8 p.m. BST. The only thing that's going to be different now is we're going to have Chill Mondays, which I've put simulation games, indie games, just vibe in. That's basically my way of saying that I'm going to play question mark. I don't know. I'm going to play whatever, but it's going to be a really uh, chill and relaxing time. Just the sort of midday, midday, restful, just vibe in, just having a good, uh, having a good, a good time on Twitch. So do make sure you check out the gaming channel and the Twitch, because there's a lot of cool stuff over there. Um, I definitely want to mention uh, patrons and Patreon, because this would not be a possible thing without the support of people over on Patreon. Like, you'll have been laughing at uh, my growing list of giant chickens that I try to read every video, uh, and is getting longer and more complicated to work out how to do it really, really isn't, like, it It wouldn't be possible without those people. I'm so, so grateful for that support, and that's part of why I want to also focus on increasing the content on Patreon, uh, having more regular rewards. I've always kept it quite low-key because I don't want to over-promise and under-deliver, so I've got a project in the works that is a secret project until it starts to come together, but within... A month or two I should have like uh, a new side a bigger side thing that I don't want to talk about yet but um, that will be something that patreon gets sort of first and full access to um, patron at the moment everybody gets uh, access to the discord if you join any tier you get access to the discord which is a lovely place we share a lot of memes and cute animal pictures and it's just very uh, friendly and nice um, everyone on every tier gets a thank you in video descriptions, although at some point we are going to run out of characters in descriptions, and that's gonna, <laughs> that's gonna have to change at some point. Um, we'll revisit that in the future when it happens. Um, seasonal merch discounts, when I launched, uh, the Emma Thorne store, uh, patrons got a 10% discount, that's gonna happen when I release the next bit of seasonal merch, which I have planned and I'm working on and something that has been requested so that's going to be really cool um and uh that will be a while because it's a seasonal thing for later in the year but what I like to do as well on Patreon is release designs early and then I can get uh people's impressions and sometimes like with the last lot of merch people said I think that would look good on a sticker so I made a sticker and so you can have that kind of in uh, input on Patreon which I think is another nice thing uh, so here's another sort of weird change. I found it complicated to g gather suggestions. I really like content suggestions. It's really useful for me. It's also good because I can't keep on top of all the news everywhere. So having people feed that to me, like, have you heard of this thing happened in my country? 
or this video came out, would you like to talk about it? But at the moment I get that in DMs on a million social media sites, in YouTube comments, in like everywhere, in different places. So I've made a really fun and exciting Google Forms. <laughs> I've got one for this main channel um, so you can uh, describe something you think would be good for me to cover and include links and stuff like that. And uh, there'll be another one for the gaming channel uh, where you can suggest games or ideas or people to collab with, whatever, you know, whatever suggestions, there'll be a specific place for you to put that and I will put that in the descriptions of every video and that should be ready now. Uh, so I'll just, as soon as this stream is over, I'll update and uh, pin a comment with those uh, and make sure they're working. Uh, and uh, yeah, that will also be on the uh, bio link. I used to have a link tree, then I started supporting NFTs, so I had to start over again. Now I have a bio link, but it's very good, and it's very shiny, and we like it, and we like them, and they gave me a blue tick, so we doubly like them. So uh, so we're gonna have everything on there, including the, um, the suggestion location, so it's easy for everyone to find. And uh, yeah, I think that's about everything. Um, like I say, next week there will be another update, which is going to be exciting for a very niche collection of people. Uh, for very specific nerds, it's going to be really exciting. Um, it might not interest quite a lot of you, um, but it'll be. I think I think it's really exciting. Um, so you get to see me and my buddy talk about that uh, next week, Saturday. I got a video coming out that is very. Uh, it's a fun and silly one, but it's also quite personal. We get a bit of Emma backstory, um, so I'd really love people to check that out. And uh, yeah, let me know your thoughts. Uh, thank you to everyone for watching live. I will just shout out Jeremy Buck, Wayne Langley, and Second Best Bob for donating during this live stream. Thank you so much. That's very kind of you. And uh, yeah, we're we're gonna do more stuff. I'm I'm slowly gonna become more of an internet person and. Uh, Try and scale up gradually, make more content. So once I link those suggestion things, definitely get your suggestions in. It's just going to be easier for me than wading through loads of DMs because I have like spam covering it and people saying weird things and inviting me to debate on whether God exists and all kinds of nonsense. So <laughs> yeah, uh, do that. And um, yeah, check out, check out the gaming channel. There is some really fun stuff coming up. I do think tomorrow's video is going to be very stupid and fun. So enjoy that. Check it out. Uh, there's no streams on Twitch this week, but do do check out Twitch. We have so much fun. There's going to be one extra stream there a week. And uh, yeah, the only reason I'm not streaming this week is because Willow and Sazzy, who uh, you might have seen on YouTube, but are also over on Twitch a lot, they are staying over and hanging out in London at the moment. So that's why no streams this week. Um, yeah, check out the Patreon if you're interested. I am going to try and scale it up slowly. Uh, and uh, yeah, lots of lots of cool stuff coming up. Lots of lots of projects. I'm going to be doing lots of reveals. You're going to get a lot of uh, selfies that's like, hey, I can finally show you this. And um, yeah, lots of cool stuff. So check it out. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for all your support. This really wouldn't be... I, I never thought this would actually be possible, <laughs> but... You guys are so supportive, watching, coming up with suggestions, just just sharing videos, every little bit really, really helps. And uh, I really like this community. I think we've managed to build uh, just a nice little core demographic that is non-toxic and pleasant. And that is such a relief and a joy for me. So I, I really, really mean it when I say thank you so much for that. And uh, I need to go and rest and have a bit of coffee and work on some cosplay and chill out so thank you so much for watching let me know your thoughts down below let me know if you have any questions if there's anything that i uh didn't cover then uh just hit me up i will put 